Hi, I'm Matu and welcome back to Matu Makes. If you have seen any of my previous videos, you might have noticed one of these cute guys. These are Ragnar and Whiskey. The two Bengal cats joined our family earlier this year. And because they are the most curious cats, they demand to be in pretty much all of my camera shots. But today, they actually perform the lead role for this video. Our bangles are really, really cute. However, since recently, whenever we want to use the bathroom, we get something like this. Whiskey is super excited about the water tap. And he has learned to open it himself or to up the pressure if he isn't satisfied with the flow. This isn't so great for our water consumption, so we put rubber bands on the tap and decided to give the kittens an alternative to play with. So I went on to design a water fountain. And haven't I done something with flowing water before? Well yes, I designed a compact 3D printable hydroponics system. It's one of my first YouTube videos. If you are interested in that video, just follow the link in the description. I thought, why not build on top of the hydroponic system? Well, not literally on top of it, but I used the reservoir I had designed for the hydroponic system as a basis for the new water fountain. As the hydroponics water reservoir is in active use, I decided to 3D print another one. Let's fire up the 3D printer and get this started. While it's printing, let's design the rest of the fountain. On top of the reservoir, I'm adding a water basin. I'm also putting in a pipe that will hold the silicone tube that's connected to the water pump. A hole in the middle allows the water to drain back down. As a faucet, I add a curved pipe that I will simply stick into the silicone tube. Finally, I add a cover for the drain. The cover is small and contains a number of holes. This part is easily redesigned and quickly 3D printed in case I want to adjust how quickly the water drains. With the design ready, it's time to 3D print the additional parts. Hmm, I thought I had more footage of the printing process. I guess the camera battery was out of juice. Then let's simply jump ahead. In the meantime, I have coated the water reservoir with two layers of resin to make sure it doesn't leak. Time to assemble the fountain. The pump is a HJ311LVGER taken from a drinking fountain for pets. The kittens actually broke the original fountain, but the pump still works. And it's done. Now for the fun part. Let's see how the kittens like it. Well, they aren't super enthusiastic, but they're definitely interested. I would call this a successful build.
this was a fun little project. In case you like the design, you can download it from Thingiverse for free. I've put the link to the files in the video description. Just be warned, if your cats like water as much as ours do, beware of floodings. I have quickly decided that this was an outdoor toy from now on. Thank you for watching and see you next time on Matu Makes.